He's not your average princess. Huh? Did I mention I studied fencing? You picked yourself a feisty one! They're not your typical Prince Charming. Come at me, bro. You don't point at me. I'm the pick this. You here. two are acting like fools. Wait, me too? <laughs> oh, boy. Alex Hudgens, Black Tree TV. Uh-huh. Alex Hudgens, Black Tree TV. Yeah. All right, I loved this movie for so many good, reasons. Good, it's good. fun and it's colorful and the music and just all of this. And mm -hmm. you, you're the candle maker. Yes. It's kind of a big deal. Yeah, you definitely. You hold the book of life. Yes. And this was your first animated role. Tell me a little yeah. bit about that. Well, you know, it's something that I've been wanting to do my mm -hmm. whole career. You know, I've been a big fan of animated movies ever since Charlotte's Web. And, <laughs> and uh, you know, so yes. Mr. Incredible Mr. Limpet, you know, that might wow. be before before some people time. But uh, so I've been a fan of, of that kind of movie making and to be an actor and to be immortalized in a cartoon character is Absolutely. pretty cool. So. I was happy to play a god like the candle maker. Yeah, come in with a bang. It's yeah, you know, I didn't want to play <laughs> a, a donkey or uh, a chicken or a wildebeest or something like that, you know what I mean? So it's kind of cool to be an actual god. But how do you follow it this now, you know? like what's, well, We follow it just, with part two. You have to always two. be gods now. Hey, man, you know, it's a hard, it's a, it's a hard job. Somebody got to do it. Somebody's got to do it, and that is you. Yes. So, you know, in this film, you mm -hmm. you hold the book of life. Yes. And, but the whole story of this movie is kind of about, you know, write your own pages, write your own destiny. Yes. You've certainly done that. A little bit. In your career, could mm -hmm. you relate to this movie in general? Totally. You know, in this in this movie, it's really about, you know, you can recognize other people's expectations, mm -hmm. but you have to adhere to your own expectations. You have to find what's true to you. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I did that a lot in my music career mm -hmm. and my movie career. And, mm -hmm. you know, as an artist, you know, I've been... You know, somewhat of a trailblazer in, in a lot of different things. You don't and, have to say somewhat. Certainly, and, uh, you know, <laughs> there's people before me, but but I just feel good that that I've written my own story. Mm -hmm. That you know, I'm not uh, you know, kind of locked into anybody else's story of Absolutely. what I should be. That was awesome, man. The giant boulders were like boom, boom, boom. And you were like choo, choo, choo. And then the cave guardian, he was like, I'm going to judge you with this giant sword. Today was a good day. The Book of Life. Were there ever times when you said, well, maybe I should have stayed more on the path that I started on or what someone else told me to do, then you just pushed through it? Never. 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 You know, I've always been confident that I know what's best for me. Well, you know, I've always uh, <laughs> understood, you know, where my bread is buttered, so to speak. And, uh, and you know, I've been very, very happy with my decisions. Absolutely. So what would you say advice for, you know, youngins coming up in the music game or in movies or whatever that are at that point where they kind of have to say, what am I going to do next? Do I do it safe or do I kind of go off and do my own thing? Well, you know, it's two things. You know, you, you always look for something that you love to do. Mm -hmm. And you always uh, try to find your true talent. Okay. And, you know, your true talent usually is the path you probably should go. You know, even if you resist it. You know, some guys are great at things and they, they want to do something else. But sometimes you have to roll with what you're great at. And, uh... And know. try to make a living at it. Uh, yeah. Okay, well, must be nice to be good at like everything then. <laughs> you, get to, <laughs> you get to do all kinds of stuff, which is awesome. I do a couple cool things. A couple cool things, yeah.